What is going on guys, Taylor? And it's your boy, Dre. Welcome to this episode of We Look at a Game We Recently Played. That I kickstarted. And then came with Game Pass. So, <laughs> so kickstarted is like the... One of the best, one of the worst ways to get into anything nowadays. Um, I haven't kickstarted anything in a while. Uh, not since the Ouya. Yeah. <laughs> no, actually, Drake, I, I've lied. Drake got, Drake got burned once and <laughs> never again. I, I actually have kickstarted a bunch of comics since then because those yeah. are more reliable. And um, I actually kickstarted a, a, a dice. Anyway, I haven't right. ever kickstarted a game. Okay. Um, I did. I played a couple. I was going to kickstart Mighty Nine, and then that came out got that. terrible. That was my fault. Uh, no, I, I mean, I helped that one. <laughs> <laughs> It looked good. I mean, I I I, I don't know what was wrong. Like, oh, cool, Mega Man. I never You're played like, no. it, but everyone was like, "This is the worst game." It, it's known as one of them. Anyway, really? so we're talking about new games, Sea of Stars. Let me ask you off the back because you kickstarted this. I did kickstart. So, so oh, what I, got you? What what captured you? Who said I need to get so the money? I am a, I'm a sucker for keywords such as Chrono Trigger and Final Fantasy. <laughs> so that's like, that's my thing, right? So I, I, I saw that's my cool, it's a retro RPG. I like turn-based, you know, like real time is fine. Um, I can't, I appreciate, but I can't get into grid-based games. Like, oh, like, like Final like Fantasy. Tactic, um, no, tactics, tactics, so yeah. tactics I, am, I am in the gray area for that. But as far as the Fire Emblem, ga Fire Emblem games, Oh, those um, are those? I didn't remember. I, yeah, so I, I like all oh, you know, if you Roy and Martha from the. From yeah, the, I know of them. I just, I've never, I imagine all, Smash Brothers helped push along Fire Emblem games. There were, like, uh, yeah, so like I, old games like Dragon Quest or Gradius or even, um, anyway, um, I'm all about turn based games. So like that caught my eye. Retro, turn based, Chrono Trigger, Final Fantasy. Like you hit all the marks for me. Like my Beano card filled up. I'm like, oh, cool, take my money. <laughs> so I saw Mo Cool, we'll play. So kickstarted it, went for updates, went for updates, went for updates. Mo Cool, it's gonna get made. It got it got backed. Awesome. I did Sam Studio. I, I played the Messenger before. You played the Messenger? That's a fun game, no. also funny. Uh, but I'm currently stuck at the last boss. I can't beat it because I didn't get enough orbs to update my upgrade my power. <laughs> so I'm like the weakest part right now at the last boss, and I suck. Um, that being said, Sam Studio made Sea of Stars, and I'm like, cool, it's coming out. It's like, oh, it's coming to Game Pass. I'm like, well, crap, I have Game Pass. So like, I'm going to get it anyway. All right. But so you it, still help it. But it's okay. Develop, I, still yeah. help, I still make it me. I still helped yeah. it get made <coughs> in a my own uh, way. So I got the Steam code because they go, what do you want? I'm like, well, I have Xbox, right? I have Game Pass, so I'm going to give Steam. So I gave Dre the Steam code, and then I played it. So we decided to play this week. Um, came out Thursday, I believe. Monday or Thursday came out. Um... So I put some time in it. Dre put a little more time than I did, but now we're more time than I did. Uh, but I technically I have way more time. <laughs> yeah. So for some reason, Dre said, "Yeah, what's the sound here?" So, uh, so if you go to the Steam Deck and sell the playtime, it'll show you six hours. But the actual when you save it, it mm -hmm. only shows me three now. See, so I've just been I don't know where that calculation is so different, or maybe I just slept all asleep in the pause menu, or I don't know. Maybe. Well, who knows? <clears throat> so I'm at least five hours into the game. Let's just do, okay, take so the difference. Yeah. Okay. So. I have my own super positive thoughts about it. Dre, you have some answers. Right. Dre thoughts about it because Dre is always, <laughs> out of the both of us, Dre is always the lesser negative. Mr. Person. Negative. Mr. Negative. Um, look, I will, let, let me, I'll start off with the good things. The game you, you can, is. You're going to lift up before you punch him down? Yeah, yeah. The game is beautifully designed. It has a like, really great design, uh, that retro art, uh, Final Fantasy, Chrono Trigger S style, yeah. top down, Legend of Zelda, Link to the Past. It has that, and even though it has that, and it has it like an elevated version of that. Like I remember walking across like a bridge and seeing their shadows appear on the wall that was nowhere near. Like okay, so they actually put some design in it. And even they even have time mechanics like where like a sunrise, sunset mm -hmm. time yeah. mechanics. So the, the game is beautifully designed. In the gameplay mechanics themselves. They're actually pretty different because they have all the basic, you know, HP and mana, but they have it where you gain mana mid-match just by attacking, and you can do like um, the the only other game I know that really did this well was Mario RPG, where you had that bonus attack damage yeah. thing mechanic. Time to time to time. Yeah, and then they had like these other magic without magic, it's the dumbest explanation, but like uh, yeah. like you get bonuses throughout game and mechanics. So the set design is beautiful. The game mechanics are beautiful. The music so far to me is just whatever. I mean, it's not bad, it's not good. It's just like, yeah, okay, this is kind of what I expected. Yeah. Where you lost me at in this game is I'm three hours into the game and I barely remember the characters' names. Uh oh. The story, I, from what I gather, and I don't want to spoil the thing, but, but we're supposed to, I, I don't get for looking for someone or something is 
theorized to happen and we're going to stop it. Um, the game was just boring to me for the first two two-ish hours. Mm -hmm. Like, back in the day when you played Final Fantasy VII on PlayStation, they had what I call a hook, right? Mm -hmm. You The first thing you did was you were in this mission, you were going to go blow up this building, and it had some pacing, high moments, slow moments, but you are just, you're in the game, you're in it, you're in this shit, you blow up this building, you fight this giant boss, you run because the building's blowing up, you're like right before it collapses. Now I'm in, okay? I don't even know what. It's, it's yeah. a movie sequence. Yeah. yeah. Now I'm in. Um, same thing with, uh, what's that one game called? Secret of Mana. You, uh, you go out and look for the sword, and by the time you get the sword, you come back, like your city's on fire, or like there's zombies are there, and they're like, you know what? You cause this, you're getting kicked out, right? Yeah. Like, okay, I'm in. This is interesting. They tried to have a hook in this game. At the very beginning, you're in this mountain, like you're adults, mm -hmm. and then it goes like to this other thing where you're training for literally like an hour and a half, <laughs> okay? <laughs> and then by that time, then you go train some more, and like you kind of pace, and it was just like, and then you finally get to where you started, and it's just like, that hook just hadn't caught me. It was yeah. just like, so to me, it was like a beautiful design game with beautifully designed mechanics that are kind of fun and interesting. They just hoped a good story would come out of it, and so far for me, that it hasn't happened. Okay, so this, um, so this one actually has because you don't play the messenger, but this, they said this is actually a prequel to the messenger, so you'll see some form of messenger mm. in there. Um, I uh, likewise, I like the way it looks, um, the mechanics. I, I do, I did appreciate the fact that you don't die per se in battle. Yeah. So you get knocked. So if you if you have your party of one or two people, or two two more people, one gets knocked down. You kind of pass out for a little bit, and then the other people will fight. As long as they stay alive, the person will come back to life on their own, like wake up with half life, and you can fix whatever. It's only when all your party is knocked out that you're done done. Um, so it's not. So there really isn't a. Um, as far as I know, I haven't seen any herbs or items that revive, revive life yet. Um, it's all just HP. Um, I, you know, not, no big spoilers, but like the the kid, your Garl friend. Who gets his eye knocked out? Yeah. I'm like, damn, that was that was harsh. That like, was so random too. It was like you could have just like, knocked him down. Like, why yeah, lose no, his like, eye? He was helping you, and all of a sudden, they comes back later. And I'm like, that's like a pirate. I thought. He was, okay, so first of all, I thought, like, is it gonna be the bad guy? Like, that is the bad guy move. Where like your friend wants to be part of you, but because <laughs> he's an outsider, yeah. he's not part of. He wasn't delivered on the eclipse moon where it was. Um, that gained these two. Um, I, I totally forgot the name as well. Um, I, I actually did write it down earlier. It was. It's, Something like Zale and Valera. Zale, yeah, Zale and Valera. That's right. And Garl. But, and Garl, yeah. I remember Garl because, like, Garl is like a gnarl. But yeah. Garl. But because Garl is a commoner, you can say, or if you're a. He's not commoner, special. Yeah. So he doesn't get to be. He doesn't get, he doesn't get to train and be become his solstice warrior like Garl. Sorry, like uh, Valera and Zeal did. Yeah. So, and then they have two other people who are mentors that they who have done this process who don't seem to be. At least the girl doesn't seem to be all that into the process. Like she's like, oh, yeah. they're they're praying again. Like when the process happens, when they actually you do finish your training and Zeal and Valera, uh, Valera um, get you know trained through their their they go from like kids to adults. Like they train and they they process. And they get the they get prayed and they get praised. The and people that were, so yeah they said so their kids so they're reminds me of Teen Titans where like all they do is train or just you know, young justice when they all do is train. Robin's always training. It's always his training. Yeah. Um, but later on, when they were having the parade, when they were like getting excited and then they're being celebrated for for graduating and passing, the the the, the mentors they had don't seem to it don't seem to be that excited about this. Like they say it's parading, yeah. they see that like something like there's something in the background happening that is just not being said yet in the story. Yeah. Um, so that's what's something that I, I see developed. Yeah, it, it it feels like it feels like it's building to something, yeah. but it just hasn't. It hasn't for me gotten there. It's not a, like I'm. I just have you found the fourth member yet? Uh, no. So the fourth member, I so I mean, I just I just defeated the elder mist. So I got the fourth member. I see the fourth member in the background looks like a little ninja, like a cyber ninja. Oh no no. Like so, open portals. No no no. Like, no no. no These are you actually find somebody and they join your squad. Oh right on. Um, it's funny they're, they're listed as cargo though. <laughs> so uh, I don't imagine she's not like an actual fighting form. Anyway, I'm just saying that's how far I gotten. So. Yeah. Even then, I like so like it's one of those things where you find someone like, oh hey, I'll join you, but we have to do this thing over here first. It's That's like where I'm at, yeah. and I, I still just don't care. Like I just don't care about anything that was going on. So like, everything that I had it was like very beautiful, uh, groundbreaking like designs. I even had like these little 
moments of animation. I think oh, they yeah. should have had more of those, which mm -hmm. would have made it more interesting. Because they the animations are so few and far between, they almost seem random. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that might, reminds me of Chrono Trigger. So Chrono Trigger didn't have animation, but when, when Chrono Trigger yeah. came to PS1 with the Final Fantasy IV, they, it was, oh. I think it was Final Fantasy Chronicles. Um, there was a two-part, uh, two-disc set. It was one Final, uh, Chrono Trigger, one Final Fantasy IV. They added animated scenes in yeah. Chrono Trigger. But it, it, like I said, it, it feels so few and far between. It just almost feels... It's almost like throws you off, like, oh, hey, that's cool to animate. And then, like, it'll just be like for four, and then, like, the next animation probably won't happen in like another hour or two. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Like I said, that's as far as I got. But as, I just didn't. There, This game is missing an interesting story. <laughs> the, the only, the, the mildly negative part about the game, and I understand why they, I, I'm trying to understand why they did, is there's no grinding. Like, for me, JRPGs or the RPGs and turn based RPGs are all about grinding. Like, I'm, I, 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 I'm all about, okay, well, I see all. I see what they're doing. So, Zenith, there's Zenith Academy where they're trained. Reminds me of um, like Zenith or Zeal, actually from Chrono Trigger when they go in the, mm -hmm. the sky layer on the, in the thing. Um, they're walking from place to place. It's very Chrono Trigger. It's the same kind of map design where they see like Planet Town Town. You don't get you don't get random encounters when you're on the road. You just kind of go there. You kind of get random encounters. You have a. Um, it's very. Uh, it's not it's a quarter game. I can't think of the game. Like, do you have enemies? You can actually run away. Like. They, like, but not, but not, not but on the main oh, map. Oh, like, though. yeah, not like, oh, uh, the main, main map. I the main, main map, yeah. Like the main map, you yeah, have a little, little sprite walking around. Yeah. Um, you know, you know, you know, encounter there. Oh, and the fishing thing was interesting. I mean. Yeah. And that yeah. was, that's also too, because I'm like, oh, cool, I'm going to forget anything. So I didn't get no achievements or anything for the first two fish you catch, much sure if you get more. Um, but those do help you when you, when you meet up later and oh, you yeah. cook one, and make One thing, yeah, I like was the whole cook. You make your, you're basically making your items for your, your healing items and then your Free magic. Zone yeah. I mean, it's, it's very interesting. Like, and they had like, I, I appreciate any game where you cook where it's like, man, that actually kind of looks good. <laughs> uh, and it's, it's the chopping of the, yeah. the, 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 and then the I say go through the whole rigmarole. Um, Final Fantasy 15 does that a lot. Yeah. I think there's, I think, and don't quote me on it, but I Go think there's a YouTube channel that went through and made all the, you know, what they could the do yeah. and all the food. Because it looks good. It's like, okay, now I'm actually kind of hungry. The dishes look good. So I, I appreciate in the game, you know, cooks and like actually makes it look, even though it's like a oh, pixel base, it's like, okay, that actually looks kind of, kind of good. And, and so that, I like, so that, I enjoy the mechanic. That was a good mechanic too. Yeah. I enjoy the defensive mechanics where you can kind of like, I'm, I'm really bad at this, unfortunately. Me too, yeah. It's like, you hit it right before you get hit. Like they have a good lot of mechanics that are there that just like, like it's like you can kind of pull it from every different game, but it, it all works well. So everything about this game works well. Except the story's hitting you. <laughs> the, the, the lack of story. One other thing is like some of the stage designs are kind of like, like they're all nice designs, but sometimes I can't figure out where I'm actually supposed to go. Oh yeah, yeah. So, um, the, after, so after the first boss in the cave, when you beat them, you go forward, so it opens to go forward. You shoot chest. Yeah. I'm like, what? The, there, well, there's no entrance. No enter. If you leave and go up to the right hand side, there's a there's a hole. Then I'm like, yeah. oh, you have to go in there. Yeah, like it, sometimes you just can't quite. And I guess that's sometimes like keep secret hidden area, or secret areas hidden. <laughs> that's it. Yeah. But then sometimes it's just like, can I get here, or how am I supposed to? Or like, oh, I can jump off this. And I like, no, I I realize at some point you can jump off these little things to explore these little areas. So I had yeah. to go all the way back. I've now realized, like, oh, I can do this extra thing where I can jump up stuff and jump down on stuff. So and it was just, yeah. So when you when you're finding the Elder Mist and you're doing your trials, did you get the questions right the first time? Yes. Okay. So you must you must you, you must have paid attention to the story enough to know the questions. <laughs> one of my I did just just guess. I was like, what if it would make more sense this one? Oh, fair but enough. two of them I did know when I 100% I know because. Cause I was I was just playing it straight through. Mm -hmm. Like I just started it and was just playing it straight through. Yeah. So the the enemies you're you're gonna fight, you're looking for the four enemies. One, two, three, four. The one that the one that like was sitting around the cauldron, looking, trying to find like. You don't know if they're enemies or they're good guys or kind of they're in the midst or they're watchers because they're the four people. They, they they're named one, two, three, four. The guys look, they look like like mages, like black mages. Black, oh black, yeah, those people that they show up like oh the time is come. Yeah, yeah and they're two, they're, yeah. they're literally named one, two, three, four. Yeah. And, <laughs> yeah, um, that, yeah. So I think those are the, the, the those as of right now. Do look at the enemies that like are trying to try, trying to stop you or what have you. Um, but those are the ones where it says they can only be defeated during an eclipse. So mm. during these during like you can you can now at a certain part of the game you can start doing the, the night and day cycle where you can actually turn you can actually not just like not just one full rotation but you can actually like stop like midway. And for some puzzles, actually, you do need to have the sun or moon uh, shown a certain way. Yeah. Speaking of moon, w when you did the when you did Valera's um, moon attack, the the moon attack special, you bounced it off back and forth. How good are you with that? 
Uh, I don't know why. I suck at it now. I was very good at it before. I, I had one good, it felt like it was going forever, like yeah. ding, 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 ding. But now I think like I only get like three. <laughs> oh. I don't know why. Like, I was like, I was yeah, really I'm good not, at it. I'm first. not sure the exact amount of highs you can get. But I, I, I must have got like seven or eight before it knocked off. Yeah. It stopped. I'm like, oh yeah, well I got seventy eight. Like as far as like eight spec damage goes, that's cool. Yeah. Um, but did you? How do you like the relics? The relics were kind of like, they, they, the relics seem to be not like cheat codes, but like they'll tell you how much HP it has for an on boss. Oh, I don't use them. Auto. Yeah. Okay, so I use relics. Apparently, sorry, I'm, I'm just a noob apparently. So it was the relics that you get. You get the relics. helper items. I think the helper yeah. items, but the relics. One relic is that auto auto uh, replenishes your HP and MP at, every, at the end of every battle. It really helps oh. out. Uh, the other the other one relic is timing. Um, like it tells you when you're about to get hit. No, no yeah, you, yeah. You know, so every time you get a time, you actually get a star that pops up and says like, okay, that means you did it correctly. Mm -hmm. The third relic I got shows the HP of every every um, non-boss enemy you have. Oh, that's not a relic. That's an item. I had, or for me, I that was a good. Oh, I had, yeah, that's an item as a yeah, thing. I had a yeah. equip to a uh, girl. Me too. Yeah. yeah. All the, <laughs> he's gonna he's gonna be my my. He's crap, the backup. Crap yeah. yeah. <laughs> he's uh he doesn't actually do the fighting. He just defends. Yeah, he has a shield. But um. But yeah. So yeah, I, yeah. I, I as far as I, I'm having fun, I'm gonna keep playing it. I'll get I'll, I'll start streaming it. Um. I'm waiting for the uh the the other shoe to drop. It feels like like uh do you remember in Final Fantasy X Titus? When you like, you go the mission, and all of a sudden, like, you realize, like, oh, you screwed up. Now like, you have to die. Since you're like, dead. Yeah, and you like get <laughs> the the whole thing like swaps. Like, oh, you refuse to die. Okay, well now it's on like that. Yeah. I'm waiting for something like that like they keep, you know, building up this mission, but it's going to get to the mission like, oh, that was all a lie, and then this, you two are like the destined warriors, and you're supposed to destroy the world or something like that. Yeah. I don't. I've never played or even heard of the messenger, so you probably kind of know where it's going to end. That's a, a side. It's a, it's a side scrolling um, kind of Ninja Gaiden esque. It says it says, <laughs> it says like Ninja Gaiden. Like people would compare it to Ninja Gaiden. Mm -hmm. but it's fun. It's funny because the there's a shopkeeper who always makes jokes with you, and that's like <laughs> the best part of the game is the, show, the shopkeeper yeah. is always talking crap. Um, but yeah, so uh, I need yeah, actually go back and finish that. But no, oh. so so far I'm having fun with the game. I'll keep playing, like I said. Uh, Dre, are you going to stop playing or are you going to continue playing? I'm pl I, it's really, because now it feels like a drag. Because the game, like I said, everything's beautiful, but like I've, I'm not this new town. I'm supposed to fight somebody. I was like, oh man, I, just, well, I that's don't all, have that's how your, your are. So the So on Game Pass, you'll actually, if you, on PC at least, it'll tell you how long it's the main story is supposed to be. Mm. 23 hours is the main story. Okay. So if you if that, so it says it's the, the main story, main story with extras, you know, like completion is like 30 or so hours. Do more stuff. So as of right now, I'm doing this. Um, as of right now, the main story is 23 hours. I'm, like I said, I'm in, I'm in like two hours in the game. Dre's three or so. Yeah. Um, so I'm gonna keep playing. I am. I have fun. I don't know. To also, me, so far, it's just, it. it's just not that. <laughs> like I'm, I, I, I hate to say, but even after I defeated the Elder Mist mm -hmm. and I defeated this other thing, it's just like, man, it's just not that interesting. There's nothing that's interesting about this oh, really? game in terms oh, okay. of story life. Hey, fair enough. Fair enough. Um, right. Everybody's like, like the story's it. just like, oh, your friend girl, and it's just like, there's just nothing. Like there's no good story. The, I. Maybe, you yeah, ma maybe like in four hours, like, okay, this is where the good stuff is. That I doubt, but I just, so me to get there, it just feels like a long slog. It's, yeah. It's been, long, it feels like up until this point, it's just been one long training mission. Okay. mission. Like I said, the like other games, you had the hook where they, they throw you in a fire, like Final Fantasy, he played Final Fantasy 15? Yeah. Like the game starts off, like the world's already like ended yep. <laughs> and you're like fighting these things. You don't know what's going on. Like they, they mostly use those like for training missions. Like this is your mechanics you can kind of expect. Yeah. And then they, they kind of go back to the boring stuff. I gotcha. Um, it needed to, it, I even felt like it tried to do that because you started off in the mountain and you know, like you're fighting the thing, but it just wasn't that interesting of a hook. So I just feel like this game lacked a really good hook. Mm -hmm. And then the, even in the following story wasn't that good. So again, Sea of Stars. I mean, if you look it up, everyone seems to love this game. Except maybe I'm I'm part of the TikTok generation where I need something that <laughs> I'm so like uh, condensed and quick or like you just need to yeah uh, I, I, such a tor short attention span I need to you, you need to hook me up real, real quick because if you don't then I'm already disinterested it feels like a slog we said beautiful mechanics beautiful game music is whatever but everyone seems to like it but me I, I don't and I, I'm not even saying I dislike the game I just feel like it's just missing it's missing it to me yeah so. okay. whatever it is yeah it doesn't have it yet can make him later who knows. 
All right, guys. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, if you want to subscribe to our YouTube channel, YouTube channel, please do so. We have new videos every Tuesday and Thursday. Come up at 5 a.m. in the morning. Um, sometimes we'll have I'll double up. I'll put two or three that day. Put five and eight a.m. Only because it hit East Coast size. East Coast eight o'clock. So when you're at work and you're bored, check out one of our videos. It's cool. Um, and Jerry, what else should they, should they be doing? I thought you said it. Said, didn't you say like and subscribe already? No, not. Oh, okay. I thought you said it in that day. Like, oh, okay. He, he covered it. Right? Nope. And I can just sit there and smile now. Uh, no, maybe you should go ahead and like and subscribe and tell us what you think. And, and on that last note, I think we're out from here, right? Yep. All right. We're out here. Thank you. See you later. Peace.